As a company, you know, Javelin is, is motivated and very interested in being responsive to our needs as an organization. So uh, my name is Eric Slicer. I'm the CTO of Porch.com. Uh, we are a marketplace connecting consumers who need to complete home renovation, remodeling, improvement, and maintenance projects uh, with home professionals to you know, very cleanly uh, get through the overall process. We're really operating a content management system right, that requires a lot of upfront data integration. It's a big data problem, but not as a kind of a big data one word problem. Right? You know, a pipeline model where we can go out and do kind of the, you know, the trench warfare of point-to-point -point integration and get data from really wherever we could find it and, and really you know, forge it into uh, you know, a high quality data asset that we could use to drive you know, this very compelling consumer experience. What we identified was you know, there was a lot of different data that we were going to work with. We, we, you know, we knew up front that we weren't going to be working with two or three data sources. And so the flexibility of an integration tool was something that was very, very important to us. You know, lots of different data types, uh, even you know, more exotic things like messaging queues. And one of the real appeals of Clover from, from my perspective was the cleanliness of the, the, the XML documents that define the graphs. There are other solutions that we looked at that gave you the ability to automate However, only when you walked away from the ability to bring it, you know, bring it back up in the designer. I think availability was also a, you know, a, big, a big thought on our minds around it. And you know, with some previous experience with Clover, you know, I think it really enjoyed the, the general architecture of how Clover is set up from a clustering and really and, and, you know, just a really well-built enterprise ETL tool. From the beginning of the venture, you know, Clover was really the first commercial product that we that we purchased. You know, given how you know data heavy we were as, as a you know from a product vision perspective, it was it was very clearly the you know the first functional tool set that we had to solve for. Cost was absolutely part of it, right? So you know, as a startup, you know, we're pretty thrifty, right? And you know, the notion of going out and spending you know you know a few hundred thousand dollars on on for what our early purposes were just didn't. The economics didn't really make sense, right? So we knew we needed a real ETL tool, right? There are a variety of open source, you know, options, but I think in general, Clover was very attractive, one, because of its price point and, you know, the capability set that we saw with the tool. Clover is a very good choice for us, given that we can use it for core integration as well as, you know, analytical workloads. You know, one of the things that, that, that I'm kind of constantly encouraged by and working with, you know, with Clover and with Javelin as a company is that, you know, the product is constantly moving, stepping forward and, you know, you know getting better. One of the big differentiators for me is knowing that there's a short path to be able to talk to people who understand the product, both at a, you know, kind of at a feature and roadmap level as well as down at an engineering level.